In a time when the biggest names in game developing will take on entire governments to defend their right to introduce little Johnny to a lifetime of gambling addiction, yet tuck their tails and run when one mom is offended by a skinny girl's fully clothed ass, Studio Foul is an indie game developer that fully embraces sexual themes in their game, Subverse. Subverse is a crowdfunded sci-fi RPG that weaves sexual encounters with your crew into the gameplay. It's described as a mixture of shoot-'em-up, tactical RPG, and Mass Effect-style exploration. You can recruit females of various races to your crew, effectively building yourself a space harem. The sex in the game serves a purpose and isn't just thrown in gratuitously. Building a relationship with each crew member unlocks various perks and abilities that can be used in the shoot-'em-up and ground-fighting modes. I don't have any footage at this time of either game mode, uh, there are some videos there of the shoot 'em up gameplay from other YouTubers, I'll provide links in the video description. It looks to be really well done and quite frankly the kind of addictively simple fun that I'm all about. The ground combat mode is grid style, so think like XCOM 2 or something. Studio Foul has been around since 2013 as is known for creating CGI adult entertainment, aka porn. They've released over 16 movies and a variety of short projects. While this is their first major entry into the gaming market, they have years of experience creating what the supporters of this game want. Sex. I checked it out and it was a little too much for me. I mean, if I want to see a cartoon girl get gangbanged by monsters, I'll just watch the first episode of Goblin Slayer. But I don't. Thankfully, the sex and subverse will be a little more tame than all that. And it's what people want. Their Kickstarter goal for this game was around $100,000. It raised over two million dollars. Maybe Anthem should have included some mech sex. The full release of the game will be on Steam and it will be for an upfront one-time cost. No microtransactions, no loot box bullshit, just an honest game purchase that gives you everything. There will be cosmetic items you can unlock, presumably some costumes for your waifus, but you don't have to pay for them. It's all unlockable by simply playing the game. At this time, I don't know when the game will release, we just have to see how the beta goes. You currently can get a beta key, but only if you've contributed $75 towards the development. Too rich for my blood, but the option is out there if this is a game you guys really want to play. So why should we pay attention to this game? Is it the sexual content? Kinda, but not in the way you may be thinking. The digital TNA included is an excellent example of an indie studio delivering exactly what their fans want with zero concern for the social repercussions. More and more we're starting to see that AAA studios no longer care for the fans, they simply care for what's in their fans' wallets. It's like the craft beer revolution. People are starting to realize that they don't have to keep drinking brand name horse piss because there's smaller brewers out there that care about the product and the people that will be consuming that product. The gaming market is being infused with variety from indie developers that aren't afraid to try something new. Or in the case of Subverse, something as old as time but highly frowned upon for whatever reason. Will I play Subverse? I'm not sure yet. When I play games, I'm there to play something that is well thought out and fun. If I want to watch porn, I'll just go watch some damn porn. I'm not going to play something just for the chance to see some CGI titties. However, if Subverse is able to blend the two together in a way where one supports the other and adds to the overall experience of the game, and the price is right, I'll certainly be willing to give it a shot. If you want to learn more about Subverse, I'll link their Discord in the video description below. For now, this is the Mangoose signing off. You guys have a good one. Mangoose!